Hey, this is Marcus on Celebrate Jesus, serving the unthinkable. John chapter 13 verse 26. Jesus responded, It is to the one to whom I give the bread, I dip in the bowl. And when he had dipped it, he gave it to Judas, son of Simon Iscariot. Network connections can lend us to anything unthinkable in the World Wide Web. It is rightly called so. If you're caught, you're trapped for sure. Judas got himself caught to the wrong web of life and invoked destruction upon himself. To the most personal question asked upon instigation of Peter, John got him an answer. Jesus showed to the rest of the men the betrayer. Jesus made a symbolic response by dipping the bread in the bowl and handed it over to Judas Iscariot. He was seated alongside with his buddies and even his feet was washed. Jesus did not have trouble with John's question. He did not think it to be a nosy one. Jesus promptly answered with his actions, but how well did the curious disciples understood it is still a question of concern. How can I serve unthinkably? Serving should be spontaneous. It should not be induced or forced upon. It should be voluntary and the beneficiaries cannot be chosen based on our biases and opinions. What do I do? Be like Jesus. He knew who was going to betray him, which did not stop him from serving him. To be precise, Judas for no reason behaved like an enemy while Jesus considered him a friend of his choice. We need to ask ourselves, can we serve genuinely and selflessly even if our ego is crushed? We need to reinforce ourselves that we serve because Jesus served and expected us to serve. We are only doing our duty that is entrusted to us. Happy Lent. Celebrate Jesus. Amen.